All right, I'm about to go to bed, call it. It's late, so this may be a little rambling. Donald Trump, next president of the United States, barring a huge miracle. He just didn't win. He won for fun. He won the electoral. He won the popular vote. He got more votes than last time uh, he was president. Just a total ringing endorsement uh, for the Republicans and Donald Trump and an indictment against the Democrats. And that's really this rant. A lot of people are asking, like, how did Trump get more votes than he got last time? Well, here's the answer. Because people like myself, independents or moderates, the Democrats gave us no choice. The Democrats gave us no choice. That was the worst campaign. And their pure arrogance and their moral superiority have driven people away. If you say you're voting for Trump, suddenly you're a Nazi, you're Hitler, you're garbage. Enough. Enough. Like, yeah, I'm sure there's racists in the party, just like there's f***ing crazy people and assholes and racists in, in the Democratic Party, all right? But millions and millions and millions and millions of people vote for Trump. He won clear, he won decisive. So when you call us that, and when you say that, you're calling the majority of the country racist, Hitlers, Nazis. I don't think you get the words of what that means. You are alienating all this middle ground people by acting like you're better than us, smarter than us, and frankly, insulting our intelligence. Trump's the threat to democracy. That was the entire Democratic campaign. It wasn't about policy because everyone knew we want change. We're not how to happy with the borders, the Middle East, the economy, inflation. And Kamala, Kamala consistently said, she was no different than Joe Biden, wouldn't do anything different than Joe Biden, last person in the room. Her pitch to the people was, Trump is Hitler, Trump is bad, he's a dictator. Again, we're not stupid. The Democrats were the one who were saying Joe Biden was uh, mentally fit for two years when he was a vegetable and couldn't even make it off stage from giving a speech. And the Democrats would lie to our face and say the videos were edited, altered, they weren't. Then after the primary is over, they stage a coup, get rid of Joe, put in Kamala, and suddenly she's the greatest thing since sliced bread. Same woman who ran for president, got zero votes. Same woman who can't even a answer a question how she's different from Biden. Ran one of the worst campaigns I've ever seen. Just strictly her entire campaign was, uh, was fear-mongering. What will Trump as a dictator be the end of democracy? It's garbage. It's garbage. The people pulling the strings in the Democratic Party, get rid of them. They've lost the plot. Tonight is on the Democrats. Congratulations, Donald Trump. I voted for him. And I felt I had no choice but to vote for him for the campaign that the Democrats ran. And it's not, not just white males, Hispanics. The black vote didn't come out for Kamala, Kamala like they did. Again, it was a ringing endorsement for the Republicans, Trump, ringing indictment against the Democrats. They got to look themselves in the mirror. This moral superiority complex they have. This arrogance they have, it's not working. It's time to wake up and see that. You're alienating half the country, more of it. Wake up, move on.